Hey, what's going on? This is Mountain Bike Champ. We're here, we're going to actually look at different variation of bikes on Trek's website. Um, sometimes people uh, need assistance with actually uh, purchasing their bikes. Um, don't know what to actually purchase. So I'm over here gonna help you. I'm gonna assist you with actually looking at, at the perfect bike to attack whatever terrain you're actually trying to get or road bike you're trying to get into. Okay, so this is the Trex website, Trek bike website. It's pretty interactive. Um, here's a Trek tab. Um, <clears throat> you got the mountain bikes, road bikes, city bikes, electric bikes, kids bikes, kids bikes, that's a plus. Uh, so you go on here, uh, you got the parts, you can buy accessories, like apparel, uh, you got different sales, and you got shops. So let's check out the sales because, you know, I, I talked to a lot of different individuals and they think, I guess, um, Trek is pretty expensive. Uh, this is just different biking apparel, you know, different sales on it right now, like the tops is a cut price, it's $59 or whatnot. It's pretty good sales. Males and females. Oh, this is plus. This is a plus right here. You need some gloves when you're biking. It's it is like a must-have to get gloves. So that's a pretty good sale. It's only eleven dollars and ninety-nine cents. It was almost fifty dollars. It's forty-four ninety-nine, and it dropped in price. So I'm a mountain guy, a mountain bike guy. So let's let's go look at the mountain bikes. Um, Let's see, full suspension, it's full suspension bikes. So it gives you a little bit of uh, literature about full suspension bikes. Um, we got a top fuel, super caliber, got these different bikes. Let's click on one that's pretty interesting. This rally looks pretty neat learn more about the rally day one squamish a little bit of a weather issue but it's mountain biking full-time riding can't get much better i sound like this bear <laughs> Yeah, I guess it shows like different videos or whatnot of mountain biking or whatnot. Uh, it shows different bikes, um, shows different terrains. Like they got like all kind of different stuff over here. They got different models to bikes. This is the electric bikes. This is the bikes that y'all be cheating with. This is the bikes that actually is made for like casual riding. You know, you go around Stormont Park, go around five miles in no time with these bikes. You know, it's charged up. Uh, it's kind of pricey. It's about $6,249 for this bike. And this one's, what, $4,749. But let me tell you, the price is not a problem. Put it on a credit card if you can't afford it. Put it on a credit card, pay the minimum payments. Because I'm telling you, a bike lasts you a lifetime. It just depends on how you take care of your bike. This bike right here is pretty nice. I like that bike right there. Um, it's an electric bike as well. Um, so it's a Power Fly 4 bike. Um, it comes in different colors. That red is pretty hot. That gray and black is tough. So let's look up my bike, Marlin. Seven, one thousand twenty nine dollars. This is the bike that I actually ride on all the time. This is the exact color that I ride. Um, it's a pretty neat bike. This has ten gears on this bike. It's pretty fast, you know. It's not the fastest, but it's pretty fast. It's dual. Uh pretty clean nice reliable bike um, again the taillights 
the front light uh, it doesn't show the front light they're typically kind of expensive it's like the package for the tail light and the front the front light is about I think uh, I think I paid about 250 for it it has a very high lumen and you know it's pretty bright if you are in the dark you will see every damn thing out there these bikes right here are the go-to bikes nowadays uh, it's pretty popular uh, one of my buddies Kelvin I used to work with he actually has one of these bikes and he loves it he seems like he really loves it um, let's learn more about it this is typically how it looks um, has the fatter tires be is able to like hit the, the the really tough terrains that that bike right there is outstanding look at the color on that bike yeah those wheels are pretty meaty um like is able to attack any terrain like any type of terrain you name it um, i'm pretty sure you got a pretty fair leverage point on this bike um what trek does that i think is pretty neat like they break things down you could purchase like you know you got the bar you, you got you break it down how much your bar will cost you place a bar or whatnot um like man this bike is really nice i i, I get i get thrown off by the like the the bright colors like exactly how it looks on this screen is how it looks in real life like the vibrant colors is like off the chain like i love the designs of track bikes like this shit is crazy yeah i think i'm gonna have to buy me one of these but let me show you my next purchase because uh i'm looking for a road bike next road performance and this is the bike that I've been looking at right here see all the models yes so this is the bad boy right here yes it's a very nice bike um, I must say it has a very expensive ticket on it these are the different variants to the bike this is the less expensive one that thinks or well, eight thousand nine hundred and change roughly nine thousand dollars very nice bike you know uh like i said trek bikes are the bike to go with um you know they got so much different accessories uh, like this is neat so the road bikes they got so much different gears like I'm telling you like you trying to go fast you trying to increase that speed you trying to increase that cardio this is the bike to have uh, when you're doing road bikes you're riding on the concrete riding on the road you're riding around parks on the concrete the skinnier tires it's not like a, a mountain bike so you gotta be mindful where you're riding and like this is the bike to get they do have a less expensive bike that i saw and the bike was about um 3200 also a track bike <laughs> um it looks similar to this right here um I'm thinking about purchasing it. Um, I think in October. Um, let's look at the kids' bikes. Uh, this is a boy bike, boy bikes. Uh, got bikes for kids. You know, it's roughly a, little, a lot cheaper. You know, it's four hundred dollars, five hundred dollars. You know. Like, I'm telling you, Trek bikes are, is the way to go. Like, you look at these different colors. Like, like it's outstanding. Outstanding. Now, let's look at the girl bikes. Gotta be fair, boys and the girls. So, it's the 
girl bikes. Yeah, so they got that little terrain uh, kitty bike. So, you know, you can order right here and then it comes straight to your house. Um, then you just have to sometimes take the bike store. If, if you know how to assemble bikes, you assemble it yourself. But um, you take it to a bike store and let them assemble it for you. Um, and uh, yeah, I think you saw the electric bikes. The electric bikes are pretty nice. They got road electric bikes, um, able to assist you when you come around them tight curves and you get tired and there's a mean hill uh, up uh, up in, in front of you and you're trying to get up that hill, but you just don't have the energy to get up that hill. Man, these bikes come in handy. This is very, very, this is a very, very special equipment right here. See, that's a little charge pack. But like I said, um, if you're looking to actually get a bike, visit the Trek website. If you're in Atlanta, Georgia, there's a Trek store, official Trek store. It is in McDonough. It's Trek of McDonough. If you go there, let them know that I've referred you. Tell them Daryl off a of Mountain Bike Champ. Mountain Bike Champ all together, no spaces. And they will see exactly who it is that referred you. Um, possibly, you know, they might give you a discount or whatnot. You just ask them, you know. Just let them know what their special pricing is for the day and, you know, go from there. Again, like this, they sell really, really nice accessories, like really nice bike helmets. Do not go out there riding a bike without a helmet, please. You need to stay safe out there, get you a nice helmet. I got a matte black helmet, so it's pretty cool. You could buy like nutritional bars and stuff, skincare. Um, um, yeah, you got like a little skincare. You got the little butter that you put between your legs uh, to make, you know, transition on the bike pretty smooth. Um, they got all kind of stuff. You got hand sanitizers. That's a must. You must have that. You know, um, I would say give this website a hit. Go ahead, check it out. It gives you all kind of different, re you got resources right here, how to fix your helmet, how to wear bike shorts, how to prevent hand numbness. That is the number one issue right there. Let me tell you, I get that a lot, riding the bike for a long period of time, like about 15 minutes, and I'm like gripping onto the bike handles. Sometimes like my, my hands just go numb, like in the middle. I don't know why, but this will tell you exactly why and how to prevent it. Switch up your hands, switch up the position, sit your back in the seat forward, ride with a bent in your elbow. They want you to stretch while you're riding. Invest in a pair of cycling gloves. All of this is perfect, take it in consideration. Um, like I said, biking is not something that you just pick up and you do it once in a while. Biking is a lifestyle, just like fitness is a lifestyle. Biking is a part of fitness. If you're trying to get into it, like I said, follow me, continue to follow me. Mountain Bike Champ, no spaces. And we're gonna show you all kind of different ways to keep fit, um, ride on different trails, um, you name it. We're gonna show you different workouts to do to actually keep your legs pretty strong, uh, keep your upper body strong, so you could be able to endure the different type of workouts, different type of hills, uh, you know, incline, decline of roads, you know, you, you name it, you're gonna be able to do it. You gotta eat right, make sure, make sure your nutrition is right, make sure you are intaking enough water. I must stress that water is the number one downfall on a lot of riders you have to make sure that you're drinking water but yeah stay connected with me and uh i'll teach you what i know all right well you have a good day you all and uh stay connected so you can see the next video
Take care.